Ebner from RV Travel Buddy, and I wanted to take the time to tell you about a phenomenon that happens here in Anacortes every year. Well, you've heard of snowbirds, which uh, people from the north go down to the south every year because of the weather, but uh, up here in Anacortes there's another phenomenon that we call sunbirding. And what that happens there is when it gets too hot down south, they come up here. But they do it a little different, and this, I'll show you how this Last works. Last summer, when Sherry and I were here full-time here at uh, Pioneer Trails RV Park in Anacortes, Washington, we couldn't help but notice so many RVs, especially fifth wheels, that don't have trucks next to them. They have cars. So we were trying to figure out how they're getting their fifth wheels here without using a truck. And this is the answer. So this is the secret. In Anacortes, there's dozens of these storage units for RVs. And what happens is the people down south, instead of pulling their trailer all the way from Arizona, let's say 1,500 miles, what they're doing is they're leaving their rigs here in Anacortes, Washington during the winter. Now this is winter time and it's April. So in another month or so, this place will start to empty out. And what they'll do is they'll contact a transport company and that transport company will just hook up, grab their rig for an average of $100 to $150, take their rig to the nearest RV park here and they'll be set up for the entire summer. Then in about October, they'll hook up their rig some more and bring them down here for storage again and they winterize them real well and for an average of only $30 to $40 a month, you can leave your rigs at some of these RV storage facilities. So think about the cost savings of these people coming from the south. Now they can just take their family car, don't have to pull an RV, don't have to store their RV at their place, or even a storage unit down south, which are more expensive. They just get in their car, drive two or three days, come up here, get a transport, and have their RV set up in a matter of a couple of minutes. It's a pretty good deal. And that's what I call a sunburn.